This is the Galaxy Note 9. It is supposedly an incremental update to last year's Galaxy Note 8. While it looks almost identical to last year's Note, Note 9 sports subtle differences like the new location of the fingerprint sensor and a totally new and smarter S Pen to boot. It even now has a cleaner and modern look. According to Samsung, this is the Note that breaks the barrier of power and performance. It's a phone that does not slow down and lets you down. This has been Samsung's commitment to its consumers, that is to always up its ante and to always exceed its consumers' expectations. This is the Galaxy Note that lets you do more. It's bigger with its 6.4-inch display and it can keep up with you with its all-day battery life, thanks to Note 9's 4,000 mAh battery, that is about 700 mAh more than Galaxy Note 8's. The new Note is faster by 33%. Under the hood is an Exynos 9810 up to 2.9 GHz clock speed thanks to its combination of octa-core CPU consisting of 4 custom CPUs for performance and another 4 Cortex-A55 for efficiency. Gamers are going to love the Note 9. Armed with a Mali G7 II with a custom water carbon cooling system, this Note is aimed for gaming. Even better, Note 9 and Galaxy smartphones users worldwide can start trying out the beta version of Fortnite for Android. And now, let's go to what makes Note a Note. The all-new, powerful, and intelligent S Pen. The new S Pen now has a cooler and much requested feature, remote function. You can now use the S Pen as a camera clicker or even control your Microsoft Office presentation. This is the S Pen we all have been waiting for. Last year, Note 8 was among the first Samsung smartphones that rocks a dual rear camera. The cameras have the ability to take low-light photos with its f1.5 and f2.4 lens aperture. It even has auto scene recognition and improved super slow-mo videos up to 960 frames per second. The Galaxy Note 9 is available in ocean blue with pearl yellow S Pen, midnight black, and metallic copper. Among the three color variants, only the ocean blue variant has a 512 gig version, while the midnight black and metallic copper only have 128 gig version. What do you guys think about the new Galaxy Note 9? Does it live up to your expectations? Let's discuss.